This means that some stranger was really eager to look into Kremer's phone. Another piece of information was found in the camera of Froon. It contained photos from the 1st of April that suggested that the girls wandered into the wilderness much earlier before their first attempt to make an emergency call. On the 8th of April, 90 flash photos were taken between 1 a.m. and 4 a.m. A few photos show that they were possibly near a river or a ravine. Some show a twig with plastic bags on top of a rock. Another shows what looks like a backpack strap and a mirror on another rock and so on. The weirdest looking picture is the one where the back of Kremer's head is depicted. Many people were trying to detect what was actually going on there. What do you think happened that night and why were there so many disturbing photos on the girl's camera?